Oh, welcome to Sonia Woman History Month in March. Another great lady is Frida Kahlo. She's a Mexican artist. Frida Kahlo is remembered for her self-portrait, pain and passion in bold, vibrant colors. She is celebrated in Mexico for her attention to Mexican and Indonesian culture and by feminists to her depictions of the female experience and form. Kalu, who suffered from polio as a child, nearly died in a bus accident as a teenager. She suffered multiple f- fractures of her spine, collarbone and ribs, a shattered pelvis, broken foot, and dislocated shoulder. She began to focus heavily on painting while recovering in her body cast in her lifetime. She has 30 operations, life experience, a common theme in Kalu's approximately 200 painting sketches and drawings. Her physical and emotional pain are dispected starkly on canvases as in her turbulent relationship with her husband, fellow artist Diego Rivera, who she married twice. Of her 143 paintings, 55 are self-portraits. The devastation to her body from the bus accident is known in stark details in the broken column. Kalu is suspected nearly naked, split it down the middle with her spine presented as a broken decorative column. Her skin is dotted with nails. She is also fitted for a surgical brace. Kalu's first self-portrait was self-portrait in a velvet dress in 1926. It was painted in the style of 19th century Mexican portrait painters who themselves was greatly influenced by the European Renaissance masters. She also sometimes drew from the Mexican painters in her use of backgrounds of tie back drapes. Self-Portrait Time Flies, 1929, Self-Portrait of the Woman in White, 1930, and Self-Portrait Dedicated to Leon Trotsky, 1937, albeit this background. In her second Self-Portrait Time Flies, Kalua used a folk style and vibrant color. She wears piecing clothing and the red, white, and green in the painting are the colors of the Mexican flag. During her life, Self-Portrait is a subject that Frida Kalu also returned to as an Artists have also returned to their beloved theme. Vincent Van Gogh, his sunflowers, remembrance, his self-portrait, and Claude Moet, his water lilies. Frida and Diego love and pain. Kalu and Frida had a trilumous tr- relationship marked by multiple affairs on both sides. Self-portrait with crop hair in 1940, Kalu is suspected in a man's suit holding a pair of scissors with her fallen hair around the chair in which she sits. This represents the time she would cut the hair Rivera love when he had an affair. The 1937 painting Memory the Heart shows Kalu paint over her husband's affair with her younger sister Christina. A large broken heart of her feet shows the end of Intensity of Kalu's anguish. Frida Kalu and Diego Rivera divorced in 1939, but reunited a year later and remarried. The two Fridas, 1939, despite Kalu twice shortly after the divorce. One Frida wears a costume from the Tijuana region of Mexico, representing the Frida that Diego loved. The other Frida wears a European dress as the woman who Diego betrayed and rejected. Later, she is back in Tijuana. Tiana dress in self-portrait as a Tiana 1943 and self-portrait 1948. Pre-Columbia artifacts were common both in Kalu and Vieira home. Diego collected sculptures and idols and Frida collected jewelry in Kalu's painting. She wore jewelry from the period and self-portrait time flies 1926, self-portrait with monkeys 1938 and self-portrait with braids 1941. Among others, other pre-Columbia artifacts are are found in the four inhabitants of Mexico City. 1938, Girl with Death Mask, 1938, and Self-Portrait with Small Monkeys, 1945. Surreal or Realist, Frida Kalu participated in the international exhibition of surrealism in the 1940s at the Gallery de Arte Mexico, Mexicano. There she exhibited her two largest paintings, the two Fridas and the Wonder Tables, 1940. Surrealist Andrew Breton considered Kalua a, surreal, a surrealistic, a label Kalua rejected, saying she just painted her reality. However, in 1945, when Don Jose Diego Levin asked Frida Kalua to read the book Moses and 
mon monotheism by Sigmund Freud, whose psychoanalysis works surrealism and based on the paint her understanding and interpretation of this book. Frida Kalu painted Moses in this painting was recognized as a second prize at the annual art exhibit. Kalu did not sell many paintings in her lifetime, although she painted occasional portraits of commission. She has only one solo exhibit in Mexico in her lifetime in 1950, just as the year before her death of the age of 47. Today, her work sells for very high prices. In May 2006, Frida Kahlo self-portrait rules were sold for $5.62 million at an auction in New York sets a record as the most expensive Latin American work ever purchased at auctions and also made Frida Kahlo one of the highest selling women in art. Wally, known for her Marxist learning, Frida also with Marxism revolutionary and a small band of contemporary figures has become a countercultural system of the 20th century. And created a legend, a and created a legacy in art history that continues to inspire the imagination and mind. Born in 1907, death at 47, Frida Kahlo achieved celebrity even in her brief lifetime that extended far beyond Mexico borders. Although nothing like the cult status that will eventually make her the mother of the selfie, her indelible Im image recognizable everywhere. At the Frida Kahlo Museum in Mexico City, her personal belongs are on, a dis are on display throughout the house as if she lives there. Kahlo was born and grew up in the building whose co cobalt walls gave away to the nickname of the Blue House. She lives there with her husband for some years and she died there. The Faculties is the most popular museum in the Goyoacan neighborhood and among the most visit in Mexico City. So she's another great woman in history that I don't know if a lot of people heard of her, but her, her artwork is amazing. And i like to thank you for listening to Sonya Podcast. Please give it a five-star review on Speaker Spotify. Where is this podcast? I please share. Follow me at SONDIA97495. Instagram, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Pinterest. You could call me here at sv seven six six seven five two at gmail dot com. Please follow my son Sounds on Instagram. Listen to his album out on Apple Spotify. Please follow Miss Car. She have her own information. T J V U C L E I N. She have a book called Black Girl Orange Cane Flex. Have a, a um album out on SoundCloud. Female Reform. Have a vintage store in New York and have a blessed night. No. Oh, welcome. And don't forget to go to my. Website http dot podcasts dot com. Like I said, I will be selling stuff. I just haven't gotten up and running yet, but when I do, I will publicly post it on my social media. And again, I hope y'all have a blessed night.